And now, your Storm Team 18 forecast. Weather from where you live. All right, as Molly just stated, yeah, a little bit of fog out there this morning, but the most dense fog right now, based off of observations, satellite data looking down toward Frankfurt, Kokomo, uh, southern portion of Miami County, so Clinton, Howard, and going down toward uh, Montgomery County, seeing the dense fog. Clinton County, Frankfurt, zero miles. They've been at uh, zero miles visibility for actually the last couple of hours, so very dense fog to the southeast, and we're all in the lower 40s. Upper 30s, Rensselaer and Winnemac, but overcast conditions pretty much widespread across the viewing area. It's going to be another cloudy day, but today will be at least we'll it'll have some chances for some peaks of sun to uh, come through. But regardless, another just cloudy kind of quiet day ahead of us, and it won't be as kind of misty as what we saw yesterday morning. 47 by lunchtime will actually warm up into the upper 40s by three and five o'clock and then we'll still keep with those overcast conditions with again maybe a couple peaks of that sun coming through those clouds. So patchy fog again tomorrow morning, but not lasting long. Won't expect too much fog because of the wind kind of helping mix that through. But temperatures in the 30s, we'll be seeing maybe some areas of drizzle in the morning for Thursday, and then more rain maybe scattered here by five o'clock to later in the evening. Thursday night, but highs tomorrow in the mid 40s for us. And Futurecast shows some of these clouds kind of breaking apart here and there for lunchtime and then turning just overcast by this evening, keeping things pretty cloudy. Now tomorrow we'll start off with maybe a little bit of drizzle, maybe a little bit of fog as well, and then we'll kind of the same story here by 10 o'clock and then scattered rain starts to work in by 3 to 5 o'clock. I think most of the heavy rain, the latest data this morning showing the heaviest rain now to the south of Indianapolis. You know, we were talking the last few days that we'll be seeing heavy rain Thursday night. But it looks like it's going to be more scattered, more widespread for southern portions for us, isolated as scattered Thursday evening. And then we'll see another push kind of come through Friday afternoon. But notice all the snow, all the wintry precipitation north, well north of our viewing area will be above freezing. And then it turns cooler just in time for the weekend. Futurecast rainfall because of that heavier push of rain to the south, uh, we're seeing a kind of a decrease and the trend of how much rain we could see. So maybe about a half an inch or maybe about a three quarters of an inch max to the south, but to the north may see just uh, maybe about a half an inch or so. So really have decreased a little bit of that rainfall for our Thursday and Friday system. So pretty breezy Friday as the front pushes through. We'll see cooler temperatures Saturday and Sunday as we get toward uh, the weekend. Obviously cooler, but we'll have a late isolated shower Saturday into Sunday. And then as we get toward our extended day, 10 day forecast, Monday looks pretty cloudy. And then we'll be watching for our next uh, heavier system. This looks pretty major here for us for some rain Tuesday. Notice temperatures near 50. And then we'll be working up uh, with temperatures falling for Wednesday going into Thursday as well. So we could be talking some snow later next week, Marley. And I want to kind of talk a little bit more about that, David. Usually we don't like to talk too much ahead because right. things can still change. But definitely looks like something might be uh, in the works for us. Yes, so watching it closely, you know, I actually got a phone call from my father-in-law yesterday said, David, all I've seen on social media is 20 plus inches of snow. Is that true? And I'm like, that's more than three days out. Never trust yeah. if you see a forecast or someone posts something on Facebook, major snowstorm or something, you know, that far out. Never trust it, uh, but uh, very f too early to yeah. uh, kind of go into yeah. detail about some snow. But regardless, it will turn cold by the end of next week. Okay, and then as far as this morning, then we're still dealing with more fog. Yeah, more fog, especially <laughs> down toward Frankfurt. Kokomo is seeing the heaviest fog, but here in Lafayette, not looking too bad, but uh, still pretty cloudy for today. All right, David, thank you so much.